Hello there, I'm Jackie Wilson, I'm the founder of Empower Education and I'm talking about the theme today of taking notice. Now taking notice to me, we can look around us and we can notice different things, but taking notice to me is all about noticing what's going off for us inside our mind. So what are we thinking? Do we ever stop to notice? What are we feeling? How often do we stop to notice? So what I would suggest you do today as an activity is think about any thoughts that you have that are limiting you. In life, there are so many things that happen and we have a great potential. Every single one of us has an incredible potential. Often we don't realise it and we can limit ourselves. We can tell ourselves a story that isn't true and that's all unconscious and we don't think about it, we don't notice it. Take notice today of any thoughts that limit you. It could be as simple as, I just can't do this, it's too hard. I just don't like the way I look. Oh, my hair's not great. I've had all these. But I stopped limiting myself. I started looking at how I can flip those thoughts into something that's more helpful. So the activity I'd really, really suggest that you do is going to help you notice what's going off in your mind. And that's a mindful um, way to be able to bring yourself into a state where you are enhancing and, and becoming more expansive in your capabilities and what you are able to do. And that's going to help you in all different things in terms of um, going into your GCSEs. It might be going for an interview. It might be um, your first day at college or whatever it might be. If we're limiting ourselves, we're making it a struggle and that can affect us um, with our mental health of how good that is or how poor that is um, just by our thoughts. So take a moment, sit down and think of any limiting thoughts that you have about yourself. Maybe not go too deep. Um, usually it's working with somebody um, to go through that, but it could be to do with your schoolwork where you're limiting yourself. Think about any challenging subjects that you have. And when you find something really difficult, what might you be thinking? When you've got that, and you've got maybe two or three different limiting thoughts, have a go at flipping them. What would be a more helpful thing to think? So sit there and how can you rephrase that thought into something that's going to help you? Because I promise you, if you've got an unhelpful thought, something that's hindering you, you're going to feel a very challenging emotion. If you're having a thought that's helpful, your emotion will change. Your thoughts affect how you feel. And of course, we want to feel the very best we can. So have a go at flipping your thoughts and take notice of those moments from now on when you have a limiting thought. Do your best to see if you can flip it. That's it for me, Jackie at Empower Education. Bye for now.